what I also have is a hose tail, different size hose tails with female JIC thread. Uh, ferrules designed to crimp onto hydraulic hose, uh, namely these ferrules are designed to crimp onto two wire braided hydraulic hose. We, these are a match to our Engimatec hydraulic hose here. Now our hose is got two layers of high tensile stainless steel braid. And, uh, this is a three quarter hose. There's actually two layers. There's one layer and then under here is another layer. And the same with this quarter inch hose. There's another layer. There's, that's the first layer. Under this layer there's another layer. And if you look at it at the end you may be able to see, for example, we take a 3.8 hose with a 3.8 shell. We push them together like that. A 3.8 hose tail. The hose tail is designed to actually push into the hose. There's actually a shoulder there. If I pull this apart, you'll be able to see. There's a shoulder that actually this locks into. All right. And this is what actually prevents the hose from blowing off at the elevated pressures that they can work at. So we actually crush this down to a certain diameter. And for 3.8, we actually crush this in a, in, a, in a hydraulic hose press. We'll crush this down to 21.9 millimeters. So currently, it's at 26 millimeters. And we have a press that can generate up to 137 tons of force to squash this from this size down to that size. So that's a finished hose assembly. 3A2 wire hose, 3A2 wire ferrule or shell, and a 9/16 JIC female hose tail, which is started life as one of these and one of these. And this hose. So the most common sizes that we come across here in Australia are for quarter inch hose, 7 16th JIC thread, which is a, this is a 7 16th JIC female swivel, this is a 7 16th male. If you want to see what they look like cross section, if you have a look at this drawing. That's the male thread, 37 degree taper. And internally, if you look at the female, you've got an internal seat in there, which is that seat there. There's the nut. And when you actually screw these together, this seat squeezes into that, gets forced into that seat and actually will hold up to very high pressures. These fittings are actually designed to be able to work up to 10,000 psi, but this hose assembly, it's the three-quarter hose, three-quarter two-wire, three-quarter ferrule, three-quarter two-wire hose, good for 3,100 psi working pressure. So it'll work all day, every day, up to that pressure with no problems at all.